All right, so this is something that a couple people have asked me is how much does the door weigh? Well, that's what I'm actually gonna go ahead and check right now. So I'm going to pull the release rope and lift this up a little bit. I'm gonna get my scale under it. And then we're going to cut the door on it. Grab a winding bar, and you're just gonna backwind the spring until it uh, until the cable slack. So oops. looks like the door is 72.2 pounds. And as you can see. Cables on both sides are slack. Hold the spring with that hand. Square old trolley sucks. Yep, about 70 pounds is how much the store weighs, so it really is not that heavy. Um, yeah, really not very heavy at all. Just pull this back out. Uh, a couple things that I did to the door, uh, well, actually the only thing, is I lubed the center bearing there because it was starting to make noise. Um, so, yeah. Pull this back. Click that in. Um, there's my remote here it is, so we'll open this up here and then I'll uh, show you another thing on this. Something's vibrating on it. Not sure what it is. Um, kind of see how far the door flies down when I pull the cord from the open position. Yeah, you can see it just kind of falls halfway down. And that, you know, it's a four by three six. It doesn't have perfectly sized springs, so. Yeah, <laughs> can't really get it perfect. Anyway, uh, you can see I have the silver metal back up with the lovely Generation 1 sensors. I've had this pair. I found this pair in the dumpster. Um, I've had these for a little while, but they're quite nice. And I'm using it with this Craftsman. It's a Sears this keypad. It's a Sears Craftsman uh, 53776. Um, this was another dumpster find. Uh, you can see that it is see that it is cracked somewhat there you go you can see it's cracked but it does work the code's just again the opener model number 9601 and this thing is still not squealing all right oh you can see here's the remote 850 cb black cased and the 41A wall button. Those vibrate a lot, but <laughs> that's okay. And you haven't seen the 8557 run for quite a while, so we'll go ahead and run this. Love the way this sounds. Sorry that the lighting sucks. start unscrewing that light bulb when I shoot videos on this. And that's about it. Um, yeah. You know what the heck, we'll do a run of the 8550 and 8365 as well. Here's the... Uh, keypad for this, just an 877LM, uh, but yeah, you guys haven't seen uh, my doors run for a little while, so why not show that quick? So there you go, there's the 8550, 
And there's the 8365. Grab my remote here and run it. an outside view of the small door. And we've got this keypad here, same as what I've got downstairs. The yellow lights, if you can tell. The uh, top fixture scrapes against the track on that side. The door just kind of settles to the side because this track dropped and that side's still slack. I might add a quarter turn to the spring on this. We'll see about that. And that one's still the same. Alright, so that's about it.